So how important is tech stack? There is a lot of discussions going around all over the internet, like which technology you should use to build modern day application and which will get you the job or which will have the most chances to get you a decent tech job. So in this video, we're going to talk about what is a tech stack? I mean, in simple terms, a tech stack is a stack of technologies you use to build applications. That's it. You can call it Monstack, LAMP stack, you can call it whatever. But these are just a set of technologies you use to build modern applications. And nearly you can build any application with any of the tech stack, right? Certainly, maybe some applications are relatively easier to be built with some tech stack than the other. But if you're building any CRUD application, then I would say you can use any tech stack you like to use, right? There is no hard rule around like what you can use, what you cannot. But there's still a confusion, a state of confusion among new developers, like what should we use? See, first of all, you should always pick a language or framework which you are most comfortable in. If you are doing JavaScript, then you should pick a framework based off JavaScript. If you are comfortable in PHP, then you should use PHP, right? PHP based frameworks. But is there somewhere a tech stack which will guarantee to get you a job? Now let's come to that point. If your goal is to get a tech job, then certain technologies will get you job sooner than some other technologies. And some people will argue this is not true, but I have been in tech for like seven years now. I know certain technologies, if you do, has higher chances that you'll get a job. And to be honest, I did not pick those technologies. I got the job. So it's not like if you only do those certain technologies, then only you'll get a job. And now you'll be curious which, which technology I should do, which tech stack I should do, so I'll get it to get a job. See, there is no guarantee, there's chances. If your sole goal is just to get a job, I would say, I would recommend you to do Java or C Sharp. That's it. If you come to me and say, I don't care, like you tell me one language and I'll do that, which will give me the highest chance of getting a job. Then I'll say Java because there are so many code bases in modern and old companies which are still using Java. So you can do that. I did not want to work in a Java framework or Java language. So I never learned that. And I've been employed since last five, seven years. It's totally up to you. If you feel like you can do anything, yeah, do like C Sharp, Java, .NET, all those technologies. I'm not against them. I just don't like them. I like JavaScript. I like TypeScript. I like Python. I try to build application in those tech stack. But if you say that the tech stack one is better than the other, I will not be agree with that. Yes, there are certain technologies which has higher chances because there, there are a lot of softwares already written in those languages. If your goal is just to get the job, then please pick those language. But if your goal is to enjoy your job, is to gain experience, is to learn new things, build new things, then you should pick a language you are most comfortable in. So just to end this debate, there is no better. There is no better tech stack. There are languages which if you search on LinkedIn or Indeed, you'll see a lot of results, a lot of people hiring, but I personally don't like those technologies. I don't like Windows. I use Mac or Linux, right? There are lots of Windows laptops, but I would want to work on a Unix based system. That's my personal choice. But if someone says, just get me the cheapest laptop, I'll say, okay, maybe get a Chromebook. I don't know, like 100 bucks or 200 bucks, right? Or get a Windows, cheap Windows or, or Linux. I don't know, like, but. I try to do things which I enjoy most because I know I will be doing that thing long term. I don't make my decision in short term basis. So to conclude this video, there is no better tech stack. The only tech stack which is better is one which you are most comfortable in. Thanks a lot for watching.